Most questions I get asked are about my skin. So I'm gonna show you guys my skin routine and we're gonna start by using aloe vera. So first of all, I use aloe vera for a lot of stuff. Like my kids have um, eczema, I use aloe vera on their eczema. And then I also use aloe vera on my hair. I make gel out of it. I use it on my face. I have a plant that I should have showed y'all, but if you've been watching my YouTube videos, you know exactly what plant I'm talking about. And she stays in the house and I usually take a piece off of her when one of her limbs starts to lean. So I'm about to cut this aloe vera open. I already cut the sides as you can see. So the aloe vera is usually like this on the side. And I go through and I cut off the sides and then I cut them into pieces and then I take a knife and I go down the center of them and open them up and then I rub it on my face. So I've never been a person who had um, a lot of acne, but around my period, I do start to get like spots here and there. Um, look, I have one little spot right there, but overall my face stay pretty smooth. Now, I do have discoloration. I suffer with discoloration in my face. Like, my eyes will get darker or around my mouth. Like, right now, um, and especially since it's wintertime, I'm looking more paler than normal. So, you can really start to see my dark spots a lot more. So, let me cut this open, and I'm going to see how I'm going to do this. That's annoying. So I'm about to just get a only do it because I can't find my scissors. So I'm just gonna take my comb. I'm just going to go down like that. So what I do, split it. See all that gooey goodness on there? We're gonna just take it, we're gonna rub it on our face. And like it got dry like that and all I do is just poke holes in it and it makes the plant like bleed out or leak out more it gives you all that good vitamins aloe vera is super good for your skin aloe vera is very good for a lot of things Close your eyes, put it, you want it everywhere. Cause especially if your discoloration is like around your eyes, then yeah. If you've never used aloe vera before, I would say go for it with like um, a piece of your skin. So I'll take my arm and I'll put it right there and let it sit on there for about 20, 30 minutes. If you don't have a reaction to it, then you should be good to go. You always want to do the skin test when you're doing stuff on your skin. Um, just to make sure that you're not allergic to it or anything like that. Um, and then for people who are like wondering, does it have a smell? It does have a slight smell. It has like a must smell. If I had to say what it smell like, a must smell is what I would link it to. And so after this, we're going to let it sit on our face for about 10 minutes. And then I can start to go ahead and while we're waiting, I'll explain to you guys my other product that I use. So in my last video, I brought up a company. It was called Zionique Essentials. And this is cruelty-free, all natural, and vegan. I found this company, um, I would say when I first got to Germany, um, I found her on Instagram. I will link her link in the in my um, description box so that y'all can go ahead and go over to her channel, not her channel, her Instagram, and um, 
follow her and then secondly order from her so this is originally how the bar comes out and looks the bar that i'm using is lemon and turmeric detox bar shea butter lemon essentials tea tree oil and turmeric so let me back that back a little bit so the bar is a lemon and turmeric detox bar the ingredients inside of this bar is shea butter, lemon essential oil, tea tree oil, and turmeric. And this is how the bar originally comes looking. It smells so good. Like, oh my gosh. Like, this bar smells so freaking good. It smells like healthiness. Like, oh my gosh. Here's my bag that I ordered it in. This is the bar that I am working on right now because I still have not finished my first bar these literally work you guys please please if you are dealing with any type of skin problems eczema i do i usually get the eczema bar for my sons if you're dealing with any of that please order from this girl her products are legit it's not filled with no crap it ain't nobody who just sitting up doing some stuff they don't even know what they're doing this girl is legit this woman she's a woman she's a queen she's a black queen anyways um her stuff is the bomb and my face is very sensitive so when i tell you this work honey i used it in my last video and i'm still using it to this day this is my go-to product i don't buy it on products at the store, no, because they break my face out. I have to have the real deal Holyfield made for this melanin chocolate skin. No, all right, so I'm about to wash this off. I know it probably haven't been that long, but I'm gonna wash it off after I wash this off with plain water, cool water, not hot water, guys. Cool water. We're going to dab our face. Right now, I usually use a paper towel, but since I ain't got a paper towel, I'm just about to use these cotton swabs, and I'm just gonna dab my face dry with these. And um, that's because a towel is too rough for your skin, ladies. Stop using it on your skin. And uh, yeah, so let me dab my face to wash off the aloe vera. You can really put aloe vera on as a moisturizer um, and then you can leave it on. But me, my face starts to get itchy after a while, so. Okay. So now we're gonna take the cotton balls. Okay, so now that we did that, I'm going to take the bar of soap, mix it with some water, Step back so you have to see. Get it nice and soapy. I really want to buy one of those brush things. You know those things that be on Amazon where you can buy and like scrub your face and stuff. I really want one of those. And James want one of those. James, he usually deals with like acne and stuff like that. So I also bought this for him. He don't use it like he's supposed to. But me, I care about my face. Like, he care about his too, y'all. Let me not damn my man. But I'm um, saying is he, I don't think he be using it. Okay. Okay, so we got that on there. And I love how you get a nice white leather. Like, you know. If your soul doing this, you know it's doing something. Like, it's a nice white, you know, consistency. Yes, sir. Hennessy is literally at the door waiting on me. So once you get it like this, we're just gonna rinse this off with cool water. Like I said, cool water is the key. Um, another thing, let me give y'all a tip. To keep your bar of soap from um, melting and being gone so quickly, 
don't put it in the shower for one if you're gonna put it in the shower put it far away from the shower head and then also we have these little let me pick this up these little things like this to hold our soap that it hooks onto the wall that's another good way so that it's not being in water and don't let you know don't let it be in the water you know what i mean because the water is what's gonna melt it it's not you that's using it so fast it's you that can be in the water oh uh, i'm gonna rinse this off with cool water cool water is very good for your skin you think oh hot water no Cool water is very good for your skin. Keep it nice and tight, honey, because we want our skin to last. Not to say or wrinkly. Okay, I'm gonna rinse this off with description box the link will be down below her bars and soap are eight dollars each go in there have a field day girl she got all type of stuff charcoal lemon turmeric oatmeal all that good stuff she even got stuff for your JJ. she got stuff for men she got stuff for kids she got she got it all right and then um oh aloe vera get your aloe vera plant or if you're in the States, when I was in the States and I went to go buy these, they would have them at Walmart and it would be over there with the fruits and vegetables and you would look at the bottom in that little box down there under the fruits and vegetables and they'll have big old aloe vera um, plants bigger than this. But mine is small because I got it off my plant. And so to keep from me having to go buy them, I just bought me a plant and I have it here and it grows, you know what I mean? 
I love plants. I love making them grow. Most of, I don't just love any type of plant, but I like plants that actually I can use and they benefit me. So I'm gonna relay my heavy hairs down and uh and finish going, finish cooking down here. So yes. is that and then another thing is i think my skin has been doing so good here but as far as my family skin like james and the kids because they have eczema they be so dry y'all so we gotta fix that and that's another reason also if you are still rocking with me you are still here. I thank you so, 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 so very much. Y'all don't know how much of a difference y'all make for my life. 